Hey guys, so today is a little bit of a mix between a play episode and a behind the scenes because I'm really not sure if this ice cube igloo is an odd masterpiece or an epic play fail. There's the other oh, that's okay. Oh, you decide. All right, so if you're crazy enough to make this, you'll just need a mold that makes rectangular, not rounded ice cubes. Now with these activities, I try to limit what you absolutely need to buy, but I love popping ice cubes out of these soft silicone molds so much easier than the hard ones. Just needed one. All right, back to the igloo. You wanna start by shaping aluminum in a circle with a lip on any kind of tray. Now Ford happened to be home with a tummy ache the day I planned to test this. What are we attempting to do today? Build an igloo. Build an igloo. And by the way, look at your new glasses. Um, so he helped me figure out the best method, and that is to add two to three layers of ice. Okay, we're doing the second layer. Carefully pour water on it. Let that gel in the freezer for about an hour. I'm going to the freezer. Mom, tell me, do a thumbs up to stop. And then you can repeat. Refill in. <coughs> Getting higher. Now pretty soon you'll find, especially if your kids are doing this, you're gonna have to get creative. Right, this is my problem area back here, very difficult to stack on. We've gone vertical. And as this got harder, I realized the shape was never gonna start getting round. So we decided to try to make a lid by putting ice cubes in the bottom of a round bowl and pouring water on top of that. All right, here goes nothing. So moving on to the day of filming. Here we go. I was like, that is an egg. What do you think? Um. Why is this not filled? Well, we're, this is the best I could do so far. My kids had a lot of energy. So we're gonna um, add yeah. this Oh jeez. I had not a lot of a plan. I was thinking we could like either play with it or paint with it. What do you guys wanna do? Paint! Paint! Okay. <laughs> but it was kind of a disaster. It's not gonna work. Is that not working either? No. Um, if you try to paint ice, it just kind of drips down. It does not actually paint the ice. It's not working. It's not working. Pinterest lies. Pinterest lies is all I have to say. No. <laughs> Realizing this was going nowhere, I decided to save my igloo. I'm saving my igloo. Bye. I'm saving my igloo. Yeah. I had some unfinished business. So later I tried to add more ice cubes around the lid to make it bigger, and Tess and I added more ice cubes to the igloo. Add it on wherever you want. If you can call it an igloo. Does this look like an igloo? Not yet, because this this finish here. So ta-da, here is the final product. Um, I, it's not that great. Nope. Although I think in this case, the fun was in the challenge of trying, at least for me. Uh, but I uh, don't know where I'm going with this. Um, hang on. Anyway guys, getting back to the behind the scenes, we test and test everything so that we do not waste your time. I should have attached the top before, but I wanted to like save it for the reveal. And sometimes things don't work out, and a lot of times that's why we miss a week posting. So I just want you to know that. But I already have my video done for next week, so I promise I will see you then. Thank you so much for watching. If you do attempt to make this, definitely tag us. I'll see you later, bye. After I'm done filming, now you're playing with it, Ford. <laughs>